What's good, guys? It's your boy, the 6 8 Cop, coming to you on today with another video. Guys, um, today is today. Today is the day. Uh, I have my sergeant's interview um, today um, for a sergeant position. Kind of nervous, kind of excited. Um, I feel like I'm well prepared. Um, I feel like I have been in play, been put in a situation that um, allows me the the best opportunity to get this sergeant position. Um, I've been running shift for quite some time uh, as a senior mass patrolman, days and nights. Um, so um, I have um, once again been put in a place that I think will benefit me with this interview um, it's all in God's hands you know I do know that um, so um, my interview is at 10 once again I am kind of nervous but it's a good nervous you know anytime you you go ab um, before your command staff with questions um, things of that nature it can kind of get a little nerve wracking um, if not you're not human that's just human nature but um, I got faith that it's going to work out um, I, I, I know God has a plan for me with this department. Uh, so I'm about to walk in, uh, get prepared mentally again for my for this 10 o'clock uh, interview and go ahead and knock this thing out. I got full faith in myself. Um, I've been doing it for quite some time now, uh, several, several, several months, almost a year running shift, um, days and nights. So with that being said, guys, keep your boy lifted up. I appreciate the prayers and everything, and I will let you know the results. Peace. What up, guys? Your boy is back. The interview is over. Man, I'm so glad the interview is over. Um, it, it was just the anticipation, I guess, was the, uh, was the difficult part. And it's kind of strange, man. You know, you... Me as a senior mass patrolman running shift, you sit behind the desk or you, you know, whatever you got going on that day, you know what to do, you know how to handle certain situations, but it's just when you are in front of command staff and they're like directing questions to you, it's kind of intimidating, you know, but in the back of your mind, you know, you know what to do because you do it every day um, but it's just the fact of them sitting down just asking you questions about what you do if that makes sense but yeah I, I feel really good about it um, we have to wait on another um, another senior master patrolman to take his interview and we should know some here pretty soon uh, I'm excited um, I felt that I did very well um, I mentioned in one of my other videos my experience with running shift been doing it for a while so it's just to me it's just kind of a situation where I you know my experience level is is there for me to get promoted to a sergeant um, all the stuff that I was studying is, with the exception of a couple questions they asked we're not on a test. Everything was kind of scenario. What would you do in this situation? Um, which again, you deal with it on a day to day basis. So when you at work, you don't think about it. You just do it. Um, but I just want to let you guys know that it is over. The interview is over. And um, when I get my results, I will let you guys know. And hopefully I have those bars on, those sergeant bars. And, um, I won't be senior master patrolman ballot anymore. I will be sergeant ballot. So um, as soon as I hear, um, I'm definitely going to keep you guys in the loop with the results. And I appreciate you guys watching this video. Peace. All right, guys. I just want to say thank you. Thank you so much for your support. Um, thank you so much for um, your prayers and your words of encouragement. Um, the results are in. So. I actually got sworn in yesterday, so I did get the sergeant's position. Uh, 
very, very proud of myself. Now um, I just, you know, thank my wife for her support as well. All um, my friends and family um, showing me support through this process. Um, we had to wait for a little while to get the results because of all everything that's going on. Um, you know, we got to get everything lined up and get everything in order. So um, I did get the sergeant position. Very, very happy. Um, I guess now my goal is to continue to learn as much as possible, continue to teach my guys, um, you know, good things about um, being in the position that they are, trying to get them ready to get my position. Um, I think that's key as a sergeant and try to get your guys promoted. Um, definitely, definitely excited about the position. So um, there are many more things I want to do in this department. Um, I'm a motor unit. I ride motorcycles, so I want to say um, in the near future, because our city is growing rapidly, here in the next year or so, hopefully I'll be able to get a traffic unit put together. Um, I love riding motorcycles. If I can do it all day, I'll do that. Um, but with time, just like the sergeant position was, um, with time. Um, I, I guess after that, uh, my next goal would probably be to, if we have a lieutenant position open up, to try to apply for that. So I have a lot of goals, man, that I'm, I'm trying to reach. And I know that with support and prayer that um, I'll be able to reach those goals. So once again, I just want to thank you guys for your support, your encouragement word, encouraging words, sorry. Um, and... Um, your prayers. I really appreciate it. So with that being said, guys, I'm going to call it a night. I appreciate you guys. Don't forget to like this video, comment, and subscribe. Holler back at your boy. Peace.